innovative, amazing science with Sunena. I believe and I hope that you are doing great. So am I. And if you want to know more about the activity which we are going to do shortly, do visit our site at www.innovativeamazingscience.in. After the exams of my grade 5 was over, me and my brother had been to Delhi for the first time to meet our cousins. Happiness was beyond control as we were meeting them after a very long time. We all enjoyed thoroughly. We visited almost all the places in Delhi and we ate a lot. One day, we were supposed to go to an amusement park and it was decided that we'll spend some time there and will return by 7 p.m. so that we can do our dinner outside. We saw all the shows put up in the park and we were just about to move out. Then my aunt said to me, you came to Delhi for the first time and if you don't watch this show, you are really going to miss something. But I was wondering which show she's talking about because we saw all the shows from morning and now it is already 7 p.m. But the show which she was talking about was at 8 p.m. And it was the last show of the day. So we thought let us just wait till 8 p.m. and we kept on talking. And finally, when it became 8 p.m., we entered the hall and everyone was dancing to the tune of the song which was played. Then came the host and made announcement about the show and the lights were switched off and the show started. There was pin drop silence. Oh my God, it was just wow. I was just mesmerized to see such a beautiful, and brilliant show. Finally, we returned back home. On the way back, we were just discussing about the show, how it was and how to try at home. And we all cousins thought of trying to do the same at home. We took the help of our uncle and finally we succeeded. So to know how to do that particular activity at home, with the minimal things available, stay tuned with me and let's get started. So the things required are, I've taken on up switch, two DC motors, two mirrors. I was not having similar size, but if you have similar size mirrors also, you can take those. Batteries with the battery holder. These are two bottle caps and I've already made hole to it. Laser light, pair of scissors, very quick. This is double adhesive tape. And here I have taken two coffee mugs. If you don't have coffee mugs, you can take any mug or any box also because we have to fix our mirrors. So you can take anything of your choice. I was not having, so I have taken these marks. So our first step is, we are going to fix the mirrors to the bottle caps. Okay. We'll use the very quick. If you have any other, also you can just use that. So let it sit for a while then we are going to take this coffee marks and we are going to fix our DC motor to them.
so now you can see that I have fixed both the DC motors on top of this coffee mugs so then we are going to take our mirrors and we are going to fix this pointers inside the hole So we are going to keep this aside. So now we are going to start with our connections. So these are the two wires of mug A and these are the two wires of mug B. So I'll take one of the wire from mug A and connect it to the mug B and twist it. And the other two wires I'm going to do the same. So now we have got two points. Now what we are going to do is there are two wires from this batteries. So to one of the wire we are going to fix it to one of these wires from the mug and twist it and the remaining one wire we are going to take this on off switch and we are going to insert it at one point and twist it okay we have got one wire from the on off switch which is remaining so we are going to Take this point from the mug and we are going to twist it. So now let us just test whether our connections are proper or not. So I'll just switch it on and we have to observe the mirrors. So both the mirrors are perfect and it is rotating. That means our setup is ready. So now I have just done the arrangement of my mugs and I have kept in such a manner so that when I'm going to like uh, focus my laser light on mug A, that means when I'm going to incident a light on mug A, that is going to reflect on mug B and in turn from mug B the light will be reflected on the screen which is in front of these boards. So let me just show you. Okay, can you see? I am showing and then finally it is reflected on the screen. So now we are going to put this laser light and focus on mug A the similar way we just saw right now and then it is going to reflect on mug B and finally on the screen. That time I am going to switch off the main lights of the room but switch on this particular switch and let's observe what is happening or how our laser show is happening.
do like it and do not forget to subscribe by pressing the bell icon which is right there on your screen and if you wish to share your experience with everyone do put it in the comment section or do write a mail so that in my future upcoming videos i can share your experience through an experiment with everyone till then take care bye bye